Hey guys and welcome to my channel and this video this is my Inktober Plus watercolor series and today is October 16th and we have already done more than half the day. I will be again using this um, sketchbook watercolor book from Hanemola and also I will be using this ink pens from Etcher from the ink pen set of 16 pens and I tell you definitely all you need you will find in that set and they're very very nice ink pens also I will be using just a pencil this is a 4b regular pencil I do recommend HB because I do want to um, want you to see the sketch so I'm using a little bit darker one but definitely a lighter one will be uh, better and some eraser and also watercolors for the watercolors today I will be using these watercolors from Etcher a few of those and probably maybe some of mine watercolors I will see that later on we will be painting color lilies today and those are my, one of my favorite flowers actually my wedding bouquet flowers I do love them a lot today I was thinking we could be painting them a little bit pink and maybe violet and something like that so fun fun uh, lilies maybe maybe we'll do one in white we'll see so let's get to our sketch first we will start with that I will just slightly tilt it like this and my uh, my drawing also I will start from the one in the center so just do something like a half of half of an oval and this stems going downwards like that that's for the one and we will have that one going from the center like that wiggling and going upwards on this side and down slightly with a slight curve inside and then go well I guess goes like that so this is it's like that this one like that so it's gonna have some like that details and here we'll have some details so like that that's gonna be our first one just change up the top slop slightly like that it's better that's going to be the first one the second one we're again going to start on this side with that oval shape just the stem going over it like that and then we'll do from this side so this is going to be our stem and again from this side and this one is going to go upwards and then up 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 wiggle the edge and downwards to here and we have one like this so it's gonna be that one again a few like that maybe curves on its top and this one also like that you can see the over part of that one so that's gonna be our second one like that and for the third one we're gonna see the center of that one again doing the just put this here so I don't smudge that one is going to be again we're starting with that curve that's looking like a quarter of an oval and this time just going on the other side opposite from the second one so this one goes on this side up 
and just do some of somewhat like a half circle but with a curvature like that and downwards so this one has a curl like that and here is the so just watch where the center is it's somewhere here it has to be aligned with the with this stem so like that it's going to be the center like that and we do have some i'm going to make this slightly thinner like that and just add a few details here so those are our color lilies sketched so hopefully you could follow this sketch i don't think it's very difficult but okay it does take a little bit of the practice so you might want to do the sketch once just on a paper and then try it on your watercolor paper and again we're starting with 05 and first gonna i'm gonna start with this one so like that and then going like that just follow the lines I I drew so like that here is center we're gonna do a basic sketch with the 05 then just those outlines and then a little bit more of the details we'll do with a little bit thinner pen this one goes beneath so like that there you go and then we have the third one this one is going to be beneath those two And like that and then the curves like that so that's gonna be the third one and now I will just get a little bit smaller this is zero one and do just a little bit of the details I did drew with my pencil some details so I will just go over it first with my ink pen and then I will erase them So just on top adding a little bit of the where those creases are or did those curvy lines I'm just adding a little bit of the ink pen so here it's below so I'm gonna do a little bit of the ink pen there like that this is slightly also above beneath so that's gonna be the first one I'm just gonna add a few lines here like that so moving on to the second one again some of the on the parts where we did those the 
curves we're gonna add a little bit of the details and here we have some shadows just beneath that one right like that and here just gonna do a few lines here beneath this crease again like that and we have the third one just gonna do again that third one again those where the where our curves are just follow those curves see what I'm doing just following those curves like that and just few there you go Not gonna do a lot more details. I believe this is going to be just fine. We're not gonna overdo that. Overdo. And now I'm just gonna erase my pencil lines. Okay, we're done with that. We're gonna start with this pretty pink from Etcher. Add that one here and just use a little bit of ultramarine to create a beautiful pink but a little bit less maybe saturated so I will just start and this part I will leave a lighter so I will do the upper part and just get the like that this is going to be pinkish then just rinse my brush slightly and I will use some green this is a forest green and I will mix it in with our I believe this is called lime green like that and just pick up just a touch of that pink to tone my greens down slightly and I'm gonna place those greens here in the lower part of my color lily like that so here also on this one and on the third one so I'm gonna put that green and do the stems also like that just at the bottom tap in a little bit more so just to make that part a little bit darker not gonna be that soft and light is the other parts like that and I will get a little bit more of this and do some parts darken them a little bit more of the pink like that and here some
So like that, some of the details with the pink. And now also I will leave this to slightly dry and I will get a little bit of ultramarine here and a little bit of this dark brown to get this gray color a light gray and I'm gonna use that light gray on this one and this lily it's gonna be slightly grayish somewhat off-white just get some of the paint out like that and with a slightly smaller brush this one actually I will add a little bit of the details here and there so some dark brown some ultramarine creating that gray it's my favorite gray ultramarine and dark brown like that and also a little bit more here up top and this part is going to be also quite dark just doing a little bit more of the details like that so that's gonna be the second one This part actually may be the darkest behind. Like that, and I will get a little bit of that pink now that it started to dry and just put it here beneath. And just slightly spread it. That mm, lovely, and the last one is going to be again that pink, but I will do it a little bit lighter this time. Add a little bit of the violet, wet that, and just let the paint this time do its thing. Just gonna tap it here and there with my brush and just not gonna go overboard like that and just get a little bit of that gray and slightly mix it in some parts with the violet that just to create interest in some part there you go a little bit of that green and paint in the central part do some details on my stems like that hmm, I like that just a little bit of the pink just to emphasize some parts so you can see we're 
not really fussing with the details, but are. There you go. Let's just get that pink now and do a few splatters and let's do a few splatters with black with um, green gonna get a little bit bigger brush and do a few of those bigger splatters and some splatters I will get a little bit of the brown mixed in with some blue and do some of those also the gray and just smudge it in some parts and that's it not gonna do anything more I believe this is gorgeous as it is just gonna top in here to create this darkest part like this and here And we're done. One more thing there is to do. That's zero 05. It's wet here. So I'm going to try to put it oops, up there. So it's color. I'm, I'm smudging it. So it's not be patient and leave that to dry. Kala Lily, this is October. Sixteenth. I do hope you enjoyed this video and if you did enjoy it, please hit the like button, share it, comment. That would be awesome if you would comment and just let me know what you like, what you didn't like. If you do appreciate it, if you do like it, you can say thank you. Also, there is a thanks button uh, down there and you might want to click on that. That is a one time donation. So you can click on it without any obligations and just see what is it about. And then the side. And also, if you haven't still, please do subscribe to my channel. That really also mean a lot to me and help you, of course, grow my channel. And guys, again, thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.